So my day at Cotton Branch starts with making sure everybody has waters, especially during the summer, making sure that all their waters are cold and clean and that they have pools to lay in and that their wallows are full. Because a muddy pig is a happy pig. And then of course there's the daily task of poop scooping and making sure that the fields are clean sure that all the medications are ready and given out to all the residents and making sure that everybody is fed which is a task with over 200 of them. So the biggest challenge I think working at Cotton Branch with COVID has been that we don't have volunteers and that there's so few of us trying to stay on top of all of the daily tasks. Waters during the summer takes about an hour each time, and I typically do them about three times during my shift, along with trying to do everything else that has to be done to make sure that the animals you take care of are all happy and healthy, which is feeding, watering, and making sure that the farm stays clean, picking up trash, picking up debris, and poop scooping. And as just one person, it's very hard to do. So we rely on volunteers for that, and COVID has dramatically decreased the volunteers. So I love working at Cotton Branch because animals have always been my passion. Even I can remember as far back as when I was like six years old, I've always known that I was going to work with animals. And now I get to do something that most people don't get to do, and that's interact with pigs, cows, horses, and other animals on a daily basis. And I get to be outside and it's just, it's peaceful here and it's rewarding because I'm working with rescue animals that you know, wouldn't be here if places like Cotton Branch didn't exist. What I wish people could see when they visit Cotton Branch or when they hear about Cotton Branch is the amazing work that gets done here. These animals are safe and happy. That wouldn't happen without Cotton Branch being here and without the people that work here and volunteer here and our donors. Walk through these fields, and you see a whole bunch of pigs that are wagging their tails, that are walking up to you to meet you. And these are animals that were starved, abused, scared of people, and now they seek out attention, and you know that you're doing good work. Having people come out and see that the work that goes on here matters, and therefore, anybody that volunteers, anybody that donates, it matters to over 200 animals.